Hey guys, welcome to my channel. In this video I'm gonna show you the stage 2 upgrades for my Anat A6. So let's begin. First thing is the new X carriage with a E3D V6 hot end inside. This is a very nice X carriage, thanks for the guy from Tingvis who made it. And it's even including this uh, nice cooling nozzle. and it's even including the place for the proxy sensor so um, I'm looking forward to install that in the future as well following the filament line now we are coming to the extruder I print the upper right frame part and it's including the holder for the extruder and as well I print this small filament guider so I can uh, print uh, flex filament easier So now I'm feeding my printer from the right side. And the whole bolt and setup looking like this now. Nice and clean. And X top switch, now it's here. This is the old uh, ZX carriage. One quick look at that as well. So as you can see, the new one is much uh, lighter, stronger and way less complicated than the acrylic one. So the left one and the right one. And the right carriage even including this belt tighter so you can tighten your belts. Now quick look at the uh, Z end stop switch. This is the new place. I had to drill um, the holes in acrylic frame and I use this uh, uh, 30 mm stands off. So it's pretty strong. Until I get my sensor, this is my setup for now. Moving on, I print this uh, Z axis support, which uh, using the bearing uh, inside this threader rod, so uh, it's holding in the place. This can help you if you have uh, Z wobbling problems. Next, I installed the MOSFET which support the heat bed so the, all the current which normally go inside the motherboard and stress the motherboard now it's bypassing the motherboard so uh, highly recommend is the MOSFET that you can do and I changed my uh, knob for the heat bed this knob is a smaller uh, my previous one was a uh, little bit bigger and sometimes can hit the edge of the frame so this one is better This is how my printer is looking from the back side. And this is how I did the cable management. And for the end, I'm gonna leave a couple of test printing videos that I did after these upgrades. Alright guys, that was my video about the stage 2 upgrades from ANAT A6. If you liked the video, thumbs up and subscribe. I wish you best luck with the printing. Till next time, take care and bye bye.